Can I just say, I'm going to miss these pickled plum onigiri from 7-Eleven so much. I don't want to know how many I've had in the three weeks we've been here. Good evening everyone! Konbanwa minasan! It's our final day in Japan. It's the evening. We spent all day just resting and tons and tons of packing. We've also been doing some boring stuff like laundry, bit of cleaning, shower, etc. Final laundry of the trip. This laundry system is really incredible. We're going to police. There's one washer and one dryer. Believe it or not, that's the dryer. Um, really, really, really lucky we have the luxury of having this time of just a spare day to just do everything and get ready to go. Um, because again, like we had three weeks in Japan as opposed to the usual week or just under two weeks people usually have. Really, really appreciating this, especially health wise, just having a day to rest and stuff. But we're going to go out for our last meal uh, and uh, enjoy some uh, hopefully ramen. I think there's a ramen place open at this time of hour. It's like almost past 10 pm. Uh, that's how long we've been doing stuff. <laughs> Uh, so much packing, but I'm actually glad that I'm managing to fit everything in. Although I've still got my like Disney popcorn bucket to put, which is this huge big plastic shell, but it's great because it actually stores a lot of things inside, so I can just shove some things in there. A little concerned about weight, but uh, my bags were like extremely light on the way here, despite the stuff I had, so I think I should be lucky. I haven't really got anything too heavy. In fact, that popcorn bucket's probably one of the heaviest things. Sleepy Evie has been my greatest travel companion ever. I can't believe I'm watching Spongebob in Japan while I'm packing, but <laughs> they have all the good seasons, this is one to three. We do not get that in the UK, we get all the bad, like, really later episodes, so whatever. Later, but you'll probably see it first, probably, before this video, so it's probably already up. I'm going to talk a bit about what I'm going to really, really miss about Japan, and maybe some things that I'm homesick for, both of us are homesick for. But yeah, like, it's going to be really weird going back after living here three weeks. I know it doesn't sound like a lot of time, but it's felt like a really long time. For some people, you, you might think that's a really long time because I agree it's a very long holiday yeah we were really feeling it this week especially and this hotel is just a little harder to relax in as well which hasn't helped but the balance of things wasn't as good as the previous week it's a little harder to get to places from here too so we have been really really feeling it and we both feel somewhat kind of ready to, to go I think although I think part of us wishes we could stay here for another three weeks if we had like the capacity I almost tripped over there <laughs> Suitcases are already like done. Mine's still like I've got last minute stuff to put in. <laughs> it's good for padding like fragile stuff in your suitcase though, actually. Anyway, we're off to go get some dinner now because we're very, very hungry. So, see you soon. Now, I'm staying in Japan and it's like 11 pm. I'm gonna miss these pretty lights that we walk down every night back from wherever we've been on adventures. This is in Kamata. These beautiful lights up here, they go all the way down the streets. Not just this street, there's quite a few. See here, so pretty, it's very magical. Thank you very nice. We're at a place called Tenkaiten, it's a ramen restaurant. It's super awesome because you basically can make your own custom ramen for however you want it, which is awesome. And you can also get sets with rice, gyoza and stuff. I'm just gonna hit Jules in the face with this. So yeah, it looks really fun and nice. Good, good vocabulary, it's the end of the night. Last proper meal in Japan. I got ramen. Like, I always expect they put me in. It's okay though, I got lots of adorable yummy 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 toppings. I could get oishi so this. The last supper. This is the greatest, slushiest outside of an arcade I've ever seen. Because of this person. Amazing. Uh oh, we found them again. What? This is weird. I think this is a weird sign. Hmm. Oh, I may have to try <laughs> later. <but> later. <laughs> Especially, like, just a little bit hyper. But cinnamon is my favorite. It is so great. Okay.
Okay, here she goes. So like that? Okay. Uh, a bit further back, just a tad. Yeah, something like that. Oh. oh, it's so hard. I don't think he's gonna go, so I'm gonna clip on the head. Yep, like yep. They're too difficult. He's like, hey, hey, hey I know. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's baby potatoes. They look a little weird to me, so I'm safe. My money is safe. And it's Kirby and uh, ignore them. And stuff really cool. Okay, so we're in another arcade and we found Ruby Dabbin. <laughs> That's quite beautiful.
Jules is all ready for traveling tomorrow because she has Mintia, wild and cruel, by Azahi. They make uh, that popular beer from Japan, so Mintia. Probably my last purchase from a 7-Eleven or convenient Japan. Got this for dessert after our ramen and arcade fun. I took this out and I was like aggressively like, yes, it looks so good. Mmm. <laughs> the seeds are chocolate cookie, people. Oh! Uh, last day in Japan, time to sleep. We really have barely any hours sleeping for a trip, but wait, it was a fun night. Pretty much packed. Woo! Well done to me. Well done to Jules over there. We did it. So, we've got our melon pan for morning breakfast. <laughs> I got some noodles as well. Hopefully I can eat those at some point. I forgot to eat them earlier. So, yep. Okay. Let's film this. Oh yeah. I was trying to find shaving foam and I couldn't find it anywhere and we know this is foam because it's a special one that we've seen in lots of videos. Mm-hmm. So. Beauty Whip. Avita. Not sponsored by Avita. I'm going to show what it does. Mm. Come on. Da, 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 da. Look at that. Oh. It just sprouted ah. around. It's why don't we have things like this back home? Look at that. By the way, this costs like seven pounds. It's not like super expensive. No. Art. Time for photos on it. Yeah. Yeah, it's been okay, but it's not like homely as Hotel Felice was. And the area is a bit weird. It's like kind of. A lot of pu well, not pubs, bars and stuff still and kind of drunk people but not like Akibara where they were all like <laughs> Akasaka <laughs> Oh, that's, that's gonna it. be in the edit oh, Akasaka <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll have a cut aside So yeah, this is the outside and you get kind of a few drunk people but not like happy ones like Akisaka more like, I don't know <laughs> Quick, Akasaka Oh, for Akasaka So yeah, the hotel room we had a we had one bed. That's been okay. So sometimes I had no covers. <laughs> there we go. Gonna sleep right now. Super tired. We wake up in like two hours. So yeah, this is the new hotel. I would not recommend. Yeah, yeah it's far out as well. So yeah. it's like 30, 40 minutes every day to get somewhere central Tokyo, like Harajuku, Akibara, mm -hmm. yeah. Asakusa, etc. Yeah. So wouldn't recommend unless you feel, hey, this place is where I want to be. <laughs> so yeah, that's our hotel room. I'm signing up for the night for two hours sleep. Probably gonna film tomorrow. A little bit. We're gonna film We're tomorrow. gonna look like this. We're gonna look dead. <laughs> Absolute dead. Deaf, walking <laughs> deaf. Okay, see you then. Bye bye. Don't forget your tea. Oh yes, tea. Good night everyone. Traveling home vlog tomorrow. Hey. Good morning, Japan. Time to say goodbye. Oh. The struggle. The struggle is real. <laughs> <laughs> Japan to greet us. <laughs> Jules is already like, oh, okay, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> well, that was an adventure. Uh, I totally just 
dripped with sweat the whole way. It's so gross, but I can have a shower at the airport apparently. <laughs> but like we had to carry all of our suitcases up, like up and down some stairs along the way to the airport. And very kindly, this lovely young Japanese lady helped put my stuff on the train and I felt so bad but she was so nice but I knew it was going to be annoying gaijin today with this luggage it's the last day of being annoying gaijin oh look where we've ended up it's almost like we've come full circle do you remember where this is from the start of our adventures hello kitty japan over there do you remember so I've got some 100 yen coins left to use up so what an excuse that is to try some gacha <laughs> Maybe some leaves? Hmm. Those are pretty cute for someone. Yep. My darlings. Oh my goodness. A Okay, a friend that really loves sheeps. Uh, the birthday's coming soon, so this may be my last sketch of in Japan. Which one did we get? Oh, I think we got this light one! Okay! <laughs> Just done one last shopping trip and all the hydrangea flowers are gone. Like it looks really barren without it. Like I'm gonna miss it. Bye bye! It's really sad. Oh. Well, goodbye to you fancy Japanese toilets with all the fancy buttons and this. <laughs> Goodbye Japan. I don't wanna go. I was really really tired. Time to go. We just bought a sneaky flat just before we left. <laughs> we saw her on the first day we arrived in Japan at the airport, so <laughs> she has come back. I knew if I did see any other flappy stuff, I'd have to get her. And I did. <laughs> no, we're going. I don't want to go. Wait, wait, I don't want to go. I'll just stay here. The sky is so beautiful today. It's so different to when we came. When we came, it was pretty, but here it's like sunny, pretty. We finished the sea season and left it as the sun came.
thought you'd get a second meal, so we're almost, almost back in the UK, but we got some nice Japanese meal, and I just had some green tea. So, a last little bit of Japanese taste, or style, of how, you know, they present their food, which is nice. That is the cutest mashed potato I've ever seen. Thank you, Japan Airlines. <laughs> Back in the UK. <laughs> there she goes, a woman of super speed. <laughs> Last plane home. Tad delayed, but all good. And I see the Mr. and the Bobby Bunnies. I'm looking forward to it. Even though I'm already missing Japan and the food and the vending machines and the gadget pot. <laughs> I'm about to take off, jet lag is hit so hard we keep falling asleep like a mm -hmm. Pumpkin Pumpkin did a big binky first. Oh, there she goes! Oh, oh, oh happy! What is she? 